Well, it's me in a blue shirt, which means it must be update time. And I've got some pretty exciting update, nerve-wracking, but exciting update. My insurance is cleared, and I have my surgery date. Woohoo! Uh, the 21st of this, I believe it was the 21st of this month, which is this upcoming Tuesday, is my surgery. Um... Today, which is the Thursday before, I have my pre-surgery uh, um, pre-surgery meeting with my surgeon and my patient advocate, and I don't know how, who else. And they're going to tell me, you know, take some questionnaire, tell me what to be prepared for. I got a call earlier in the week about, uh, you know, asking me, you know, I'm telling me that I'm going to have to take off my rings, my wedding ring and stuff, and uh, bring my CPAP, you know, for my sleep apnea. And tell me some certainly on my check in, it'll be 6 30 in the morning, which I hate mornings. I really do. There's really only one 6 30 according to me, and there's a PM behind it. Um, but yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. They're going to give me the information today. I'm going to pay them a whole bunch of money today. And then Thursday, me and my wife will be up here, and you know, I check ins at 6 30. My surgery could be around 7 30. I'm not exactly sure how long the surgery is going to be, but then uh, I'll probably give you an update when I leave here today, and I'll try to do an update when I get here on Thursday morning. But, you know, pretty soon I'll be updating you from the hospital bed or soon after. So uh, thank you for all your prayers and keep them up because, well, the surgery itself doesn't necessarily worry me. The guy who's been doing it has been doing it for several years. And I don't really, I'm not too worried about that. What I'm worried about is the fact that my heating habit is this. If I was to eat 12 crunchy tacos, it would taste awesome. It would fill me up. I'd be as full as a tick. But as soon as I finish eating it, I would want to eat again. Uh, like brain hunger or whatever. And some people who have this surgery that goes away... And they pretty much just eat to survive. That's kind of what I want to be. That's that's what I'm hoping. That's what I'm praying. But a lot of people may lose that for a week or two. Or they might wake up from the surgery hungry. If I do that, that really worries me. Because this is not something I can have reversed. I can't have them say, okay, put the stomach back in me. It's going to be something i got to live with for the rest of my life. I guess what I'm worried about is having buyer's remorse. So, I'm just hoping that this goes well. That's the only thing I'm worried about. Um, and we'll see how this goes. Bye-bye.